Municipal Reconstruction Project and Porto Press. Porto Press, as the capital of the Republic of Haiti, the construction of its municipal infrastructure requires a high starting point and high standard, hence significantly improving the level of infrastructure services and boosting social and economic development. The municipal infrastructure project mainly includes five parts. Roadworks consist of upgrading and reconstruction, widening, rehabilitation, and transportation facilities. The scope covers 12 main roads with accompanying facilities, total length about 100 kilometers, with road drainage being an important part of the works. The anti-flood water level is for the flood rarely happens in a century. The interception and drainage of the flash flood adopts fortification criteria that can prevent flood rarely happens in 50 years. Rainwater collecting system is designed for storm water rarely happens in three years. The rainwater are collected by the pipeline and discharged along the river and sea. A water purification plant of 225,000 cubic meters per day will be built in the urban area with rain truck pipe to provide safe and pure potable water. The wastewater will be collected by sewage networks, traded in the new 180,000 cubic meters per day sewage treatment plant to required standard, and then discharged along the river and sea. The new sewage treatment plant will adopt a process flow of pre-treatment, primary treatment, and secondary biological treatment. Environmental health works consist of public toilets, garbage collection and transportation system, and waste landfills. Public toilets are built at city road sites, public areas such as stations, parks, and residential areas. Garbage collection and transportation system consists of waste bins, waste collection and transfer stations, and various vehicles. Timely disposal of garbage within the day is expected. Landfilling is used for domestic waste with a design capacity of car 1,500 tons per day. Power supply works includes the construction of a new gas-fired power station, LNG pod, and upgrading of the distribution networks. The planned capacity for the distribution network is 2,000 megawatt, and the installed capacity for phase one power plant is 600 megawatt. Adopting 275 kilowatt transmission line. While meeting the power demand of Port of Press, the plant may supply the power to the whole country. The communication works can provide the government and security department with quality urban security defense system, city transportation management system, command and dispatch system, and electronic police system. Meanwhile, it also can provide the citizens with high-quality mobile phone and internet services, etc. Due to the destruction caused by the earthquake and hurricane, reconstruction of the city of Port-au-Prince is highly needed. In the planning of the city reconstruction, the new city hall will be the central landmark, which is designed to add more modern flavors and functions on the previous building. To substantially improve the quality of life for people in Port-au-Prince, the regional municipal infrastructure construction is expected to be completed in three years, hence contributing to the brilliant future of Port-au-Prince. Let's make Port-au-Prince a healthier and livable home for generations to enjoy. <laughs>